In this video, I will show you how you can get this style of taskbar inspired by macOS Dock on Windows 11. Many of you probably updated to the latest version of Windows 11, 23H2, as I did myself, and many of three popular options to customize Windows 11 taskbar, like Taskbar XI, Rounded TV, and others stopped working or have some kind of glitches. Now, in this video, I want to share with you working version of Rounded TV currently in canary stage, which works with the latest Windows 11 release. I will show you how to install it and how to configure it to work well with the Windows 11 23H2. So without any further ado, if you are interested in my current desktop wallpaper, make sure to check out the first link in the video description and let's get started. Now, the first thing which you want to do is open your web browser and let's go to this link, which I will also provide in the video description right below the like button. Now, you can easily see that this is actually a forked version of the rounded TB because unfortunately the original developer abandoned this project. If you go to this link, you can then go here to the releases. And if you scroll down, you can see this October 16 build of this program. Now you can scroll down and you go here to the assets. And now you can click on this .7zip file. And this should start the download of the rounded TB. Once this is complete, you can click on this folder icon next to the file. And then you will be redirected to your downloads folder. And then you can just select this file like so and then you will click on the extract all here then you will click once again extract and it should extract the folders inside your downloads folder now with this program you will don't need to actually install it you will need to place it somewhere safe on your c drive or d drive but i don't recommend leaving it in your downloads folder because you can accidentally delete it so what i will do i will go back to this pc go to local disk c and here at these folders, I will create a new folder by going on the top left and click on the new. Click on the folder like so, and then I will call it tweaks. Press enter, then you will navigate back to your downloads folder. Then you will right click and click on this scissors icon. You navigate back to this PC, local disk C, to your tweaks folder, right click and paste it right here. Now you will open the folder once again like so. Once you are inside this folder, you will see this application which has .exe at the end of it. If you don't see .exe file, you will go here to the view and you will go here to the show and make sure that you enable here file name extensions. And now you should see .exe ending of the program. Once you have it, you can then double left click to open the file. And once it's open, you should see the screen which looks something like this. You can just press OK like so. And then you have here a few of the configuration options for this program. The first thing which I highly recommend of doing is going to the bottom part of your taskbar on this arrow. And then once you have this program icon of the rounded TB, you will need to right click on it and then make sure that you select here run at startup. So every time you will reboot or start your computer, the taskbar will always look like the macOS dock. Once you are done with this, I highly recommend that in this rounded TB configuration options, enable dynamic mode and then you will need to click on the apply at the bottom right. Now what this will do, this will segment the taskbar to different sections like the widget, like the time, the date and also the middle part with the icons and the start menu. When this is done, you can click here on the show tray and make sure that you then uncheck this and then you will click apply once again. And now you can see that this program is kind of glitch right now. So what you will need to do is go here to the settings, navigate here to the personal Personalization. scroll down and here down below click on the taskbar now scroll down once again click on the taskbar behaviors from the taskbar alignment which is currently set to center make sure that you change this to the left and then back to the center and then you can close the settings if this doesn't fix the issue for you then i highly recommend that you go back to the rounded tb folder which contains the rounded tb.exe file and then you will basically open it once again and this should reconfigure things on its own and now you can see that this fixed the issue that we had with the taskbar once the taskbar is fixed if you let's say maximize the window you can see that the taskbar expands Depends on its own. So if you go back here to the system tray, you can right click on the rounded TB icon and then you can click here show rounded TB. If you want, you can also customize features of this program here even further, like when a window is maximized, restore the taskbar. So this means that if you maximize the window, the taskbar will go to the full width. 
Now here you also have when Alt plus Tab or Windows plus Tab is pressed, restore the taskbar. You also have here two more options which I don't recommend to enable because they have performance issues and also may cause flickering issues. When this is done, you can here also change the corner radius, the top margin, left margin, bottom margin and the right margin as well. But I will leave everything as default. But you can also already see that if you have this icons expanded with the names in the taskbar, you will see that this taskbar also gets kind of glitched. So what I highly recommend is that you go back to the settings once again and then you will navigate to the personalization. Down below you will go to the taskbar like so, click on the taskbar behaviors and scroll down and make sure that you have here this option which is called combine taskbar buttons and hide labels set to always. Now this should fix the taskbar misbehaving. And now if you also see the issues like I have them here, you will basically go back to the romnet.tv folder and then you will open the .exe file once again and this should reconfigure things on its own and fix all these UI issues with the taskbar as you can see right like so. Let's say if you don't want to use this program anymore, it has many of the glitches or you don't like it anymore. So what you will need to do is make sure that you have the taskbar expanded like so, so you can see the arrow at the bottom right. And then once you have this icon here of the rounded DB, as you can see here, you will right click and then you will ma make sure to select here close rounded TB. And now this program should be closed. And now you can also go here to this PC, local disk C, and then in the tweaks folder, you can just remove the folder like so. And then if you go here to the search and search for the recycle bin, you can go here to the recycle bin, click on the empty recycle bin, and then you will click yes. Now just restart the computer and you should be good to go back to the default Windows 11 taskbar. Now I think this is it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure that you check out the first link in the video description for the wallpaper pack. And I will also leave all the required files in the video description down below. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel would also be much appreciated. Have an amazing rest of your day, guys. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.